The Transport Organization reported that several Polish metro stations, including Bellard, were flooded. A month worth precipitation fell within an hour. Torrential rain have left Polish following a recent heat wave in France that followed metro station in the French capital. The journalists were in the bus in the south of Polish when water poured through the doors, reaching feet on the passengers. It was scary, Lawrence said, because we could see the water coming down and we weren't sure if we were going to get out. Another residents of French capital filmed a motorcycle driving through the deep water irony saying the parish is beautiful because you can ever go what will ski on here. The water station on the Ile Tower recorded a wind speed of up to 104 km on hour. Meteorological survey reported that the level of the sun rose by 35 cm due to heavy rain. The parish fire service issued a warning a local residents instructing them to how to stay safe during the downpour, advising them to stay at home. French weather service said much of southern France could be hit by storms later this week. Hurricane Gerard to which left 19,000 homes without power and damaged roads, rail and fire roads from the high winds and down the trees. Middle of France has warned to increasing winds and heavy rainfall in the southwest as well as associational snowfall over the massive central and Fian crosses the country from the southwest to the northeast. France Mountain's highest level of orange level warning in this region due to storm general hit the country. French Meteorological Service Middle of France is earlier statement warning to dangerous weather including heavy rains, possible flooding and strong winds. Well, initially, over 26 departments were alert in orange in the morning. State emergency supplier Enidis announced a blackout of 75,000 customers this morning, especially in the northern and western parts of the country. Storm quickly crossed the department of Ile de France, a neighboring region without causing significant damage despite strong gusts of hail.